Hey, what's up? Easy Overdose here. So, if you have Pure Block and you really don't know how to set it up, this video is going to help you a ton. Especially if you game. This is mainly meant for gaming, but this works for like anything. For like Ventrilo, for AIM, for whatever. You can do this for anything. So, basically, like, you load up a program and you have Pure Block blocking so much shit that it blocks what you don't want it to block. So, you could right click and you could allow the IP permanently, but a lot of IPs for like games and stuff are dynamic. So even though you allow this IP today, like it could be different tomorrow and you're going to be allowing 100 fucking IPs before it's over. So what you want to do is once you get the IPs that are being blocked, all you need to do is uh, just copy it to the clipboard, go to Google, and then type in IP who is and you're going to go to one of these sites it doesn't really matter which one i prefer this one ultra tools because it seems like they don't have a limit for the amount you can look up so you just enter the ip address in here on the site and what you're looking for is range or net range it might say something like that on a different site and this is the range that this uh, Treon owns. Treon owns this uh, server, the entire range. So I needed to go in to List Manager, go into my Permanent Allows. Now, if you do not have this list Permanent Allow, you need to allow permanently allow one IP, and you do that, and it'll create this list. So then we want to go in here. And that's at 20894. So I actually don't have a 20894. So I'm just going to add a new one. And this is for Rift. So I'm going to 20894 204. 27255. So that, double check it, make sure I typed it right. So that is going to allow the entire server. So anytime the IP changes, anywhere I go in the game, assuming that the entire game is stored on that uh, range of IP addresses, um, I'll be good to go. I'm not going to get any like random disconnects when I'm going through like a loading screen or something because it's going to a new zone and it's going to a new IP address and you'll be good to go so hope that helped you guys out and see you on the next one